cooked. It's a new year in a new kitchen and with a new baby. Yes. For me. Congratulations. And hopefully some new results in the two years we've been yes. absent. So if, yeah, it's been two years, which is insane. But if you've been watching Uncooked, basically the gist of it is wanting to make meals um, based on recipes, mm -hmm. but our skill level is kind of low. Correct. But we think that with our powers combined that we can kind of like figure it out together. Right. So we actually put a poll on Facebook and mm -hmm. asked what you wanted us to make between the choices, fluffiest pancakes, molten lava cake, sushi, sushi and beef, beef wellington. wellington. And y'all chose beef, beef wellington. wellington. So that's what we're making today. We've got the ingredients here and I think we should just dive in. Let's get started. Okay, so our first step is to make the mushroom mixture. Okay. So we need eight ounces of mushrooms. Got it, I bought white mushrooms. There was like other kinds, but I figured that this was like the most common one. But I think probably we wanna wash this. <clears throat> Doing it. Over here. Oh. <laughs> New kitchen. Dang, eight ounces is a lot. You're yes. dripping everywhere. <laughs> Can you eat mushrooms just like this? Yes. Are you lying? No, you can. <laughs> what do you okay. think they're like a drug time? <laughs> I don't know. I never did mushrooms. I mean, me either. <laughs> <laughs> the recipe called for fresh thyme. Of course, Deanna <laughs> brought this and said it was fresh. It's not. Whew, half strong. Of We're just going to go with half of a half. So okay. what is that for? I don't do math or fresh. Yeah. How is this going to blend? There's no liquid. <laughs> The motor's gonna burn out. It's okay, water. let's let's take it off and let's like mix it and then we'll put it back on. Like go like this. Yeah, there's no liquid in it. I know, no, no, but it will create its own liquid. It made a little bit of a difference. Yeah, it did. Yeah, I have an M M machine at work and so a to what? get M M&M M for M Ms. And um, to get more M Ms, I always shake it up. <laughs> and That's it the dispenses same. like eleven M Ms. I'm also on a diet. It's <laughs> <laughs> gonna take forever. I know. We Legit pace. Oh, God. Taste it. Smells. <laughs> <laughs> that smells so bad. Tiana, you're missing all of this in here. Oh, hold on. I'm doing one thing at a time. Gosh, I can gas. Do you not know how to light a burner? <laughs> oh my gosh. You're going to burn I the house down. I saw the fire. Pre Megan's old heavy. stove didn't have medium on it, so I had to guess between it 10 and 5. It definitely had medium on it. <laughs> if it's the numbers, obviously. Yes, I know now. Yeah, I don't know if the smell is supposed to be so pungent. Ew, it's on me. It's on me. <laughs> this looks like refried beans. <laughs> liberally, liberally? Liberally. Liber liberally. Like that a lot. sounds very political. No. <laughs> am I saying it right? Heavily salt and pepper the beef tenderloin. I wish we had fresh pepper. I wish we had fresh thyme. <laughs> Just let it cook for a minute. Okay. Yeah. Like, don't it... leave the spoon in there. It'll melt. <laughs> I need a paper towel. Just put it in the spoon <laughs> holder. Oh! Is it supposed to boil? <laughs> I don't know, that looks really gross. I feel like an animal is about to come out of there. <laughs> Maybe this is a paste with it when it comes to cooking. I mean, because obviously you're not going to eat stuff that is like glue. I think that that's probably good. Mm -hmm. Megan just moved to a new house and needs new pants. House oh, rude. Gift. Rude? I'm, I'm, try I'm trying, trying to get you a pan, girl. <laughs> Why do I need new pants? Because you only have one. I don't cook and I don't even shut, have, no, I have more than one. I have, shut up. I'm trying to get you a pan. I have, <laughs> I have more than one pan, just not like that. Megan needs to put on her love sweater. It's getting cold in here. <laughs> Megan, this isn't liberal. You need more than this. No, we want that meat to be all the way seasoned. I did. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> no, it says liberally. This is, I did it a lot. <laughs> okay. In this pan, heat two tablespoons of neutral oil. Wait, 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 wait. What's neutral oil? Neutral oil is... Olive um, oil? Yeah. How do you know? <laughs> <laughs> you don't know at all. No, I think it's probably more like cooking oil. Once the oil has begun to smoke, quickly sear the tenderloin pieces on both sides. Oh, geez. Smoke? And then we're going to sear there's... fire. Yeah. Fuego! <laughs> what is <Once> sear? <laughs> I think you just hold it in the oil. That seems really dangerous. <laughs> I feel like I'm in the jail stance. <laughs> She's about to drop the hottest <laughs> album of 2018. Are you ready for this? Don't 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 don't
Let's look with this. <laughs> oh no! Oh, that looks good. That looks really seasoned, actually. I love pepper, so I don't think that there can ever be enough. I put pepper in my popcorn, and one time I put so much pepper in my popcorn, I was literally choking and dying eating popcorn, and I put more. Whoa, hot fire's coming out. Why'd you make it look so easy? Because it was like <laughs> Oh, it calls for English mustard. We don't know what that is, mm -hmm. but we looked it up and it says that it's a bright yellow spicy mustard. So we're gonna combine. Bright yellow spice. We're gonna combine both. It said that English mustard <laughs> is extremely <laughs> spicy, so we're gonna add a pinch of cayenne pepper. That, make, that seems right. Ooh, your spice drawer is so organized. I hate this drawer. <laughs> <laughs> well, Mrs. Dash never hurt anyone. Okay. Oh, 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 or a lot. Oh, that's watery. <laughs> <laughs> well, we don't have much time to use it. <laughs> oh yeah, that's spicy. Oh yeah. I feel like I'm making a picture. I just want to like put little shapes in it. Okay. Well, Megan, these are very mustardy. Great, great job. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I like affirmations and she won't give them to me. You're doing a great so. job. Okay, so. <laughs> says that we want one sheet roll, thawed, rolled out, and cut into two seven by seven squares. <laughs> Wait, you have <laughs> How did you get seven? Nine. Nine. Seven. My hands are clean. <laughs> yeah, but this ruler's probably not. <laughs> so the recipe calls for a fourth of a pound of sliced ham. We've got deli meat. What are you doing? I'm just on tall I <laughs> This does not look good at all. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I put this there. Are you sure? Yes, I've read it three times while you were out doing whatever. I was doing the other thing you instructed me to do. You gave me a lot of instructions. That's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> this looks so good. <laughs> it's like dog food. <laughs> Who's eating this? <laughs> we are, girl. <laughs> Layer with another piece of ham. Got it. And close the Wellington by folding the puff pastry over the center of the meat. Oh, yeah, we got that. Ham it up! Okay. Shut down, pucking. I Oh, I like your technique. Oh, you took some <clears throat> off? Should I take some off? <laughs> <laughs> yes! <laughs> okay, lightly brush the outside of each Wellington with egg wash. What's egg wash? Um, eggs for sure. <laughs> I assume just like a beaten egg, right? Is it water. A beaten egg of water. Eggs and water? Okay. Okay. So like one egg? That makes sense. It's like a clean egg. One egg Washed. and water? I've always wanted to do egg wash. Using the back of a paring knife, don't know what that is, lightly score the tops of the pastry in a checkered pattern. <laughs> so what? Draw checkers. Let's just make designs. <laughs> Look at mine. Oh yeah, do that smart. <laughs> if it comes to scoring and checkers, I'm a win. <laughs> it's going in the oven! Hey, hey. Oh. <gasps> oh my god! We're scissors. You need to scissors. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, yeah. Party foul! <laughs> Why? Why did this happen? It doesn't say that it has to be even cut. Ingredients have to have every single thing that you do. We should have done beef wellington for dummies. There is no such thing. I looked it up. <laughs> the lining was literally on the bottom. All right, take two. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, I'm so excited. Look how golden it looks. Here's our beef wellington. Moment of truth, people. We're gonna cut into it. We have no idea what this is supposed to look. All right, exactly. Okay. <laughs> this is so nerve-wracking. <gasps> oh, 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 sweet! <laughs> okay, now we have to taste it. <laughs> okay, cheers. Cheers. <laughs> It's good. It's, good. it's really good, actually. We nailed it. I don't really understand the point of the ham, to be honest. Or the mushrooms. I don't taste them at all. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's really good. Mm -hmm. Well, guys, I think we need to take a little toast, because I'm pretty sure uh, we nailed it. We <laughs> nailed it. So I will, delicious. Yes, I will say probably the most challenging part is figuring out what the point of the mushroom in the ham is. <laughs> <laughs> 
It like melts in your mouth. It does. The meat it is, is so good. Perfection. Also, don't leave parchment paper over because <laughs> it will catch on fire. Almost to fire. Overall, I think we should name this a success. success. So cheers. cheers to that. Girl, we made this and creme brulee. Yeah, we did. We're going to have a fancy dinner. Thanks, y'all. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Can you say hi? Hi. Hi. He just woke up. <laughs> and this is very overwhelming. Little <laughs> bridges. Dad? What? Huh?